I've always been a skeptic when it came to the supernatural. Ghosts, demons, and all those eerie tales never fazed me. That was until the night I experienced something so horrifying, so otherworldly, that it shattered my skepticism forever. It was an ordinary evening like any other. I crawled into bed after a long day, my eyelids heavy with exhaustion. As I drifted off to sleep, little did I know that my peaceful slumber would soon transform into a terrifying nightmare. In the middle of the night, I woke up, or at least I thought I did. My body felt strangely heavy as if invisible chains bound me to the mattress. Panic surged through my veins as I realized I couldn't move a single muscle. I attempted to scream, but not even a whisper escaped my lips. My eyes darted around the room, and that's when I saw it a sinister, shadowy figure lurking in the corner. My heart pounded, and beads of sweat formed on my forehead. The creature's glowing eyes fixated on me, and its twisted grin sent chills down my spine. I was paralyzed, not just physically but emotionally too, as if all hope was sucked out of me. I tried to convince myself it was just a dream, that I would wake up soon, but the terror was all too real. The shadowy being approached, its dark tendrils reaching out toward me, brushing against my immobile body. I wanted to look away, to shut my eyes tight, but I was trapped in this haunting reality. As the creature drew closer, I felt an overwhelming sense of malevolence. It was as if it fed on my fear, growing stronger with every ounce of terror I exuded. I tried to muster up courage, to fight back against this evil entity, but my body remained frozen, a mere spectator to my own nightmare. Time seemed to stretch endlessly as the creature toyed with me, its form shifting and contorting into grotesque shapes. Every instinct screamed at me to escape, but my limbs were unyielding. It was as if I was a prisoner in my own mind, my body held captive by this malevolent force. Just when I thought I couldn't endure it any longer, a faint whisper echoed in my ears. It was a soothing voice, familiar and comforting. It told me to stay strong, to believe that I could break free from this sinister grasp. With every ounce of willpower left in me, I focused on that voice, determined to fight back. As I mustered all my strength, I felt a slight twitch in my fingers. It was a tiny movement, but it was enough to reignite hope. I concentrated harder, pushing against the paralysis. Slowly, agonizingly, my limbs began to respond. With one final surge of determination, I broke free from the invisible shackles. The creature shrieked in anger, vanishing into the shadows as I regained control of my body. Gasping for breath, I sat up in bed, drenched in sweat, and my heart pounding like a drum. Since that night, I've struggled to find answers. Was it just a vivid nightmare, or did I genuinely encounter a malevolent entity in the realm between sleep and wakefulness? Regardless of what it was, I now know that the line between the tangible and the intangible is far more blurred than I ever believed. And so, I share my harrowing tale with you, hoping you won't brush it off as mere fiction. Sleep paralysis is a doorway to a haunting world of terror, where one can encounter their deepest fears and confront their inner demons. Be wary, my friends, for the realm of shadows may be closer than you think, waiting to ensnare those who dare to close their eyes. And that concludes today's tale, my fellow adventurers. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like and hit that subscribe button and ring the notification bell so you never miss out on the next thrilling chapter of Law's Tales. Until next time, keep questioning, keep exploring, and keep wondering about the unknown. Goodbye.